Welcome back to the Bulldog Insider. The Fresno State men's basketball team has won two games in a row, both by blowout. We're joined now by senior guard New Williams. New, you've been on fire recently. You scored 24 points in Friday's win over IUPUI. You're averaging 20 and a half points per game in your last four games. What's been working for you? Um, just being confident out there on the floor, uh, taking advantage of opportunities that present themselves on the court, and you know, just having my team behind me, having the coaching staff behind me, and having the fans believe in me, and you know, so it's just been a really good stretch for me in terms of you know confidence and and playing how I want to play. You guys are playing well right now. You look at your record though, and you see four and seven overall. Of those seven losses, three were in overtime. No moral victories, as we know, for close losses. But what do those types of games do for you in the long run? Uh, they build character. Um, they give teams understandings of who they are and crunch time and what they need to do in order to close out games, in order to win games. Um, you know, all of those games were winnable games for us. So it taught us a lot about who we were and what we needed to do to make sure that if we're ever in that position again, that we can capitalize on those uh, opportunities. There's a lot of talent on this team. We're seeing some of it right here. It's a very deep bench. Seven guys have played in all 11 games. You've played in nine. What's it like having that many players who can contribute every night? Uh, it's great. Um, you know, you don't want to have any drop off with, with guys that are coming on the floor and, and we don't have that problem. Um, everybody contributes and, and everybody can score the ball. You know, we want to make sure everybody can defend the ball and those are big emphasis for us. So when, when we have a team of guys that can do that and, you know, you can go down the line on the bench, um, it just makes it very easy to, you know, have that culture of winning. With so many good players on the team, is there a healthy competition to figure out who's the best player? Do you guys do that? Talk about that? No, we actually haven't. Um, <laughs> Sometimes that does happen, though. We, we, haven't, we haven't really been thinking about that. We've just been trying to, you know, start gelling together and, you know, build that chemistry with each other. But I feel like once that camaraderie comes, then we, we will start to have that, those conversations. New, it's still early in the season, but you guys are already dealing with injuries, not having Noah Blackwell and Jared Hyder. How does that change things on the floor? Uh, it changes things a lot. Those guys are, are really good playmaking guys, especially uh, Noah. Um, those are two of our main pick and roll guys. So um, it changes a lot on the floor. But like I said, you know, we, we don't really want to have any drop offs. So that's when me and Mustafa come in and, and try to pick up some of that where it's lost. You guys play the San Francisco Dons tomorrow night, seven o'clock game at the Safe Mart Center. We know the Dons are 10 and three and they beat Cal this season, a team that beat you guys. What else can you tell us about the team you're facing tomorrow night? Uh, they can all shoot the ball. Um, they're a poised team. Um, they understand how to play the game, and you know they they really know how to find their guys, especially in transition. So San Francisco tomorrow night, and then you see Riverside on Saturday, and then you guys are getting ready for your next conference game. How do you not look ahead to San Diego State? Uh, by just playing it one game at a time. You know we we don't really want to look too far ahead in the future. We know that that will be a big game for us, but we want to take it one step at a time and, and take on the challenge that's in front of us and make sure that we give that our utmost attention because, you know, every opponent is a big opponent in our eyes. Christmas Eve is Tuesday. Christmas Day is Wednesday. As a kid, what was the best gift you received? And you can kind of pair that with your favorite Christmas memory. What do you got? Um, hmm. That's a tough one. Uh, Are you an Xbox guy? Did you get a new bicycle one day? I'm a PlayStation guy. Okay. And that's what I was trying to remember when I got my first PlayStation. I think I was eight and it was a PlayStation 1. What do the holidays mean to you? Um, they mean a lot. You know, that's it's family time and time to, you know, re, uh, reconnect with, with family members and, and loved ones and, you know, Show them your appreciation. He's New Williams. Catch him in the Bulldogs tomorrow night against San Francisco. And then on Saturday against UC Riverside. In between, invite him over for a Fortnite tournament. Right? You guys play that, right? <laughs> New, thanks so much for coming in. Happy holidays. All right, thank you. Happy holidays.